Hi people, it's Raylan and welcome to my new house here in Nashville. I would love to give you a tour, so come on in. This is our kitchen. I am so obsessed with the kitchen because I really wanted it to have a traditional feel but also be very modern at the same time. And as you can tell, my style is kind of like this boho western feel. I love colors, but I also love a lot of neutrals too. So we tried to incorporate some plants, which I'm so obsessed with, some cactuses, some ways to like really kind of touch on the um, just southern part of my style, being from Texas and all. This is the living room, which I'm obsessed with because I love the high ceilings and I love a fireplace, especially being in Nashville. I didn't get to use my fireplace much uh, growing up in Texas because it was always so hot, but we definitely get awesome winters here. And um, I love having, finally having a fireplace, which is so much fun. Of course, the touches of cactuses, um, just the more plants, the better. You can't have too many plants. I'm pretty sure I have like 50 plants. I'm not even kidding you. I'm definitely a plant mom. So this space I love so much. I love having instruments just all around the house because you never know when you're gonna wanna pick up one and create. Um, this guitar was given to me by Blake Shelton when I was on The Voice when I was 17. And this guitar I got from Gibson. I've always wanted my name in a fret, in the fretboard, and so to be able to have that felt so awesome. And then this is one of our first pictures of when we were dating, me and my husband. So I just love this corner. It makes me so happy. I feel like when designing a home, every corner counts. And so this is one of my favorite corners in this house for sure. Another thing that you'll find in our house is random little sayings that just make me happy and make me laugh every time I walk by them. This was something funny that I found at this little market here in Nashville and it just says nice butt. So anybody who's walking by, you can feel a little confident after you read this, all right? All right, so now we're going to one of my favorite places in the house, which is um, our porch. I've always wanted a nice back porch. And one thing I love about this house is there's nobody behind us. So you genuinely feel like you're in a tree house. So I'll come show you this part. Welcome to my little slice of heaven. I have always wanted a back porch. I feel like every country girl wants a back porch. And I'm so thankful that God gave me this one because I love it so much. I kept the boho theme out here. When I found this chair, I, well, I actually had this chair in my last house. And so when I saw this porch, I knew it had to go on the back porch. I love this chair. I love the mix of green and I really wanted a little bit of shade on the porch because it gets super hot during the day. And then we had the idea of putting um, this green wall up and I just think, first of all, for Instagram, you always need a picture spot and this is the perfect picture spot. As you can tell, I'm very obsessed with plants. I have a lot of plants and I name my plants. Call me weird, I don't really care. This is Jessie, named after my best friend who got me the plant. Um, this is Figgy in the back for my fig tree. We have Martha over here, little pink, little pinky over here. And um, this little guy doesn't have a name yet, so maybe you can help me figure out a name for him, which would be awesome. But yeah, this is, this is the porch. I love to create here, and I love to spend my time here in the mornings reading and just catching up on things, and it's been a really great space to have. Okay, so I want to take you back inside to show you where all the creative magic happens. I love this area because it represents so much of me and my husband's life and just where we are now. And so this piano was given to me by my sister. It was her piano that my grandmother had got her when she was three years old, when she just started learning how to play music. Since I'm the one in the family that does music for a living, I was so honored that my sister gave this to me, especially knowing that it was in my grandmother's house, which means the world to me. I love above the piano to look up and to see where me and Josh are from, which is Texas and Georgia to have that little piece just of my heart every time I create and look up there. This just makes me so happy. And like we said, I'm definitely a plant mom. You see all the plants, I'm obsessed with them. My favorite artist of all time in the whole wide world is Dolly Parton. So I had to have some Dolly vibes. Her, these are some of my favorite records of hers. And um, so having that just definitely brings inspo to this space. So over here is, I just, I've never had a wall to put all of my things, so I was so excited about getting this house to be able to put everything that I've accomplished on one wall. 
um, just different concerts that I've gotten to do. My plaques for when God Made Girls went platinum, and then Love Triangle going gold, and then just doing, being a part of the Country Music Hall of Fame, the American Currents in 2016, having my Opry debut outfit in the Country Music Hall of Fame was one of the coolest moments of my whole life. Um, being on tour with Miranda Lambert was one of the highlights of my first huge tour, and so all these are just milestones in my career that I just love to just stare at and just dream of bigger milestones I want to hit, but to see what I've accomplished always keeps me super inspired. Thank you people for stopping by our new house that we love so much. If you remember that back porch, it's calling my name because it's me and my husband's margarita time. So, ciao, au revoir, bye out. <laughs>